Hello, sweet team. Welcome back once again to a fierce kitchen where friends and family cook. If today is your first time joining us, a warm welcome to you. Today, I'm sharing with you the famous green marinade recipe you can store in your freezer and use as a base for your soup, your stews, the steaming of your meat, your chicken, for all kinds of things you can think of. It makes life so, so easy. So without wasting much time, let's go right into it. So for this famous green marinade recipe, I have some green bell pepper here. I have some three bulbs of onions, medium sized. I have a bulb and half cloves of garlic. I have some pakoshito, which I had in my freezer. I tried to find the green habanero pepper, but unfortunately I couldn't get some to buy. And I have some basil here with me. And then I have some parsley. And then I have some ginger. I have some green onions, fresh ones, and some I already had stored up in the freezer. And then I have the fennel. I'm going to go ahead and cut all these up to facilitate the blending process. Marinade have been nicely cut. So I'm going to go ahead and put them in the blender and then blend them to a smooth texture or a coarse texture depending on how you like it. You can as well incorporate your own vegetables as you wish. You really don't necessarily have to stick to this these vegetables you can incorporate your own favorite vegetables if you wish to help for a smooth blend of the marinade i had to put some little water that is about um half a cup of water or even less to make the blending process smooth So in order not to add in more water to my marinade, I left some of the first one I blended in the blender to help blend it easily. So for this marinade left in the blender, I'm going to go ahead and add in some rosemary to have different flavors. And trust me, this recipe has been tested, tried and tested. You can never go wrong on this. If you have this in your freezer, it is really, really, really a lifesaver. And it is a must try. So our rosemary incorporated green marinade is all ready. I'm going to go ahead and pack them into the ice cubes container and then freeze them up nice. I do not have a funnel cup, so I'm going to go ahead and transfer some into this. I'm improvising this. And one one of my friends will, <laughs> one of my friends will say, You better get all your tools before you come you come to us with recipes. idea don't even give this a thought remember to buy all the things you need for this green marinade the next time you visit the market because this is really going to save you a great 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 deal of time trust me so i have covered this up nicely with a cling film so that it can go into our freezer and cool up there nicely into the ice cube shapes we want them to so this is the marinade that has the rosemary so i'm going to go ahead and 
do the same thing as I did to the first one. So the only thing that will help me differentiate between the two is that these cube containers come in shapes of love and then the is it the penguin or something so my marinade with the rosemary is also covered up nicely in the cling film so i'm going to go ahead and store this in the freezer as well so this is a green marinade that has been nicely frozen Shout out to Sweet Ajeli for sharing this amazing recipe. So I'm going to go ahead and pack this into my freezer bag and store them in my freezer so I can get them and grab them any time I am about to cook. So our first bag is ready. So thank you so, 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 so much, sweet team, for sharing your time with us we really appreciate you appreciate your support until i come your way in the next video keep safe and don't forget to let your little light shine bye if yes kitchen dead 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 Oh, so tasty!